Hi and welcome to a new video. With a screen time passcode, you can protect the setting that you have set to limit or disable certain features on your device. But what if you want to turn this feature off instead? In this video, I will show you two effective methods to remove the screen time passcode on your iPhone even without your Apple ID credentials. Let's go! Screen time is an iOS feature that enables users to effectively manage and track the amount of time they spend using their devices. It provides the ability to customize restrictions and disable specific features on an iPhone according to personal preferences. The screen time passcode, on the other hand, is designed to restrict access to the screen time settings, preventing unauthorized changes to the limitations you have set up on your device. But what if you prefer to have unrestricted access to your settings without requiring a passcode? Assuming you still recall the Apple ID and password that you initially used to set up the screen time passcode, turning this feature off is a simple process. However, if you don't remember these credentials, you can skip directly to the last time step. To start, open Settings and navigate to Screen Time. Scroll down to the Change Screen Time Passcode option and tap Turn Off Screen Time Passcode. Then you can simply enter your passcode to turn this feature off. Otherwise tap Forgot Passcode instead to start the discovery process. Enter the recovery Apple ID and password to proceed. Once the authentication is done, the Screen Time Passcode should be turned off successfully. To make removing the screen time passcode easier, you can use a third-party software instead. This method is especially helpful if you also forgot and lost access to the recovery Apple ID you provided when you first set up your screen time settings. For this, I recommend iMyPhone Lock Wiper. Before I discuss this in more detail, you should first disable Find My on your iPhone to avoid recovery conflicts later on as required by the software. Open Settings and tap on your name above. Navigate to Find My. Go to the Find My iPhone menu and toggle it off. Now, how to use iMyPhone Lock Wiper. For your reference, click the tag in the top right corner or the link below to download the software. Lock Wiper is specifically designed to unlock and remove iPhone passcode or Face ID, Apple ID, MDM lock and screen time passcode. It also lets you remove the screen time passcode without losing your data, so there's no need to back up your device. This program is available for both Mac and Windows PC, so choose your operating system and click the download button. A trial version is also available which allows you to verify if your device is compatible or not. To experience the software's full features, a premium subscription is required. Once downloaded, run the file and follow the on-screen instructions to install it on your computer. After installation, connect your iPhone to your computer using an original or an MFI certified cable. On your iPhone, enter your device passcode when prompted and click Trust to confirm the connection. From the dashboard, click the Unlock Screen Time Passcode configuration. If your device is running iOS 12 or higher, the interface should automatically load to the Unlock Screen Time Passcode. Otherwise, the Recovery Restrictions Passcode will display instead where the program shows the actual Screen Time Passcode which you can then use to easily remove it from your iPhone. The next step is to select whether the screen time passcode was set directly on your device or through family sharing. Either way, the unlock process is similar, so just follow the on-screen instructions to continue. To begin the removal, click the Start button. Since Find My was already disabled, Lock Wiper can now automatically remove your screen time passcode. When finished, your iPhone will restart and the screen time passcode will be removed. And that's it! If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. See you next time. Bye!